Uh, 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 Sonic rolls out new pulled pork, barbecue cheeseburger sandwich, and tachos. Lunch is served. Tachos and Sonic. Ladies and gentlemen, I don't, it's think good you, celebration. I don't think you said that right, Roger. It's National Tater Tot Day, mother bleepers. That's right. <laughs> Let's go. Don't sleep on this ass. Let's go. <laughs> Man, that is a good day. Holy smokes. This show would be so much more interesting on satellite. <laughs> that bomb's flying. Absolutely. <laughs> Molly, you're going to love this. What? You ready? What? Yes. Yesterday, we moved my dad. And the, the, the moving company that we use is a, a client for the other radio station, right? A big client. Roger's been doing endorsements with them forever. So... They get there and they send two young bucks. They're probably maybe 23 years old, maybe. Hi, do they have an accent? Uh, I wouldn't go there with these two. Mm -hmm. Oh, baby! Each of them, unbeknownst to the other, at one point in their day, said, So, are you JP's dad? <laughs> oh no! To JP. <laughs> Examine the facts. What do they know? They know they're moving a guy out of what? They What's know. the place called that your father was in? It's called Brightview Senior Living. Oh boy. Okay, so there was like an obvious high school. Listen, these kids, I, they were great. They worked hard. Yeah. But it's like they think senior is forty plus. As far as yeah. I hope so. I hope so. Because I mean, at their age. The difference between 50 and 85 is like an hour and a half. Yeah, yeah right? that's true. But they had two different moments. Like, there's no. So, <laughs> one happened as soon as they got there, and the kid was getting out of the car. And because on the. On all the paperwork, it just says JPWBAB. It doesn't say John Parisi or anything like that. So, they must have been going out, you're doing a job for JP's dad or whatever the hell it is. Mm -hmm. So then I'm there. <laughs> I meet them. My father's not there. I already have my, because I took a bunch of his stuff and moved it myself mm. and brought it to, so he had stuff to do out. while we were waiting for the movers and that, you know, that thing. And so the, the, one, the first one happened like right out of the chute. Like, so you JP's dad? I'm like, no, I'm JP. Oh, well, all right, cool. You know, and that's it. They didn't say, oh, sorry. No, no, no realization. No, one of them no realization that. whatsoever. Neither no, one no. of them had a clue. Man, oh, man. The amount of mental damage that they just did. Zero. <laughs> and then later on in the afternoon, <laughs> when they were leaving, when they were about to leave my father's, like the place he was going from. How about ducks? Oh, they're being the kid, kid. Like, say, you. To be like, okay, no. guy. Mm. And he's like, so here's your kid's dad? I'm like, yeah, no, dick. No. <laughs> Uh, why are you so old? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, but it wasn't a good day. 23 years old. It wasn't a good part of my day, I can tell you that. Yeah. yeah. I mean, yeah, I had that even when I was a kid. I mean, absolutely anybody who was yeah, in your 30s or older. 30s, 40, I mean, 40s or older. So you know, it's just a bunch of That's all. No one knows. They know enough to know who JP was. Yeah, well, Simon's on the But they couldn't, I mean, so what am I, they think I'm moving, like, JP's oh. in, his, in his 20s, and I'm his dad. Uh, I want to smack the snot out of these kids. Yeah. Mm. Not good. They worked hard. You know what, you I know what they say to me? Hey, are you, are you Monica's daughter, is what I hear all the time. I'm sure they do. I'm a good dad. Are you the young piece? Are you the I would, I would believe that, by the way, some of those pictures you posted, yo, those classes, what were you thinking? I love those classes. I wanted Why? to be Sally Jesse piecemeal so bad that I, I, wore, I bought the red ones like that, but they were a BOGO situation. And, and Sally Jesse piecemeal? I called her that. Why? Because it was funny to me. And I so never Jesse Raphael, who you called Sally Jesse Peace Smell? Peace Smell. Peace Smell. Peace smell. P word. Anyway. <laughs>
stick to traffic lady. Oh, your girl. <laughs> that's, what I, that's what I will always call her. I'll stick to that until I die. But anyway, so oh. I got those red glasses that were round like that, and they were huge. And then I was like, and they were BOGO, and I was like, oh, I want this white pair because that would be even more cool. So I have a big-ass pair of white glasses and a big-ass pair of red glasses, and I loved them. Uh, I have... Um... Something else I noticed, but the pictures are they're old and some of them are like from a little bit further away. And I'm gonna ask you a question. Mm. And I don't want you to get mad. Okay. But I gotta ask you. What? Uh, so your issues like with your thyroid when you were out of the coma and going into the coma and all that stuff, they were like kind of hair issues, right? Like maybe some of your hair was falling. I had a bald spot when I was in junior high, yes, continue. gentleman in the one picture was no. Caco Guadalupe. I'm like, no, that was my Uncle Felix. But, um, so what do you say? Uncle which picture? Felix. Wait, I don't remember that one. There was one of them that I looked at. It was one of them that I looked at, and I was like, she's going to the list. We got Caco Guadalupe. Guadalupe. Now we have Uncle Felix. Yeah. That's a great name. Yes. <laughs> really? That's great. Uncle uh, Felix. Yeah, and I thought you never went to California. It was at a time zone thing. No, it was oh. absolutely California. Or did I misunderstand? That. No, no, I've been there before. I went most recently, maybe six, seven years ago. Um, <laughs> but, but I don't like it. It's the worst. But my aunt Lisa gave me for my graduation present. She full on paid for the hotel room. We went to uh, the. I mean, I'm sorry, the airline. We went to Disney World. We went to Mexico. We went to Alcatraz. Every, and we went to a concert. Um, and, and we just we did all the stuff, and she paid for it. So. You went to Mexico, like Mexico in Epcot. No, they don't have Epcot out there. So you went into the real Mexico. It was Tijuana. Do you have any problems getting back across? I didn't tell you that story. Isn't that the worst place to go it's for the... real quick? It's horrible. It's yeah, I was running from the cops when I went. So, yeah. right, well, it was right. the scariest. Uh, you have to keep in mind, this is right along the same time of when um, run for the border was the was the, <laughs> was, the, was, the, was, the was the whole Taco Bell saying. But oh, no. we went there, and we spent all day, and it was fun, and I had a great time, and, and all was well. Wife. And then we were um, coming back. And, and like, it was super crowded, you know, walking through the, we, we walked, we parked wherever I walked, and we were walking through this, like, customs or whatever, and it was packed, and understand that I'm four, eight and a half, and I want to say it was a little smaller than even, I don't know, but I was just, I'm short, and there's all these people, and we kind of got lost in the shuffle, so my aunt and my uncle were up there, and I'm all like, well, you know, where am I, or whatever, and I come, I, they, they, they let, they went right through, they stopped me. And I'm like, well, I'm stuck on this side, and I'm 18. I guess I have a driver's license, but literally just, I mean, my license is a New York license. Uh, it's it just all very, very. Uh, you look like younger than you are. They might I think they're look, trying to smuggle a kid out all of All of it was, yeah, I, I look super uh, young, all of it. And so I was, and then and my aunt and uncle don't know, because they're, they're right waiting for me on the other side. They're like, what's taking her so long? Would she stop at the bathroom or whatever? They finally understand that, I, you know. Uh -oh. I know, I know. It was, that was probably That's the scariest good. thing. That's what? not good at all. What? Friday off. Can you guys hear us? Yes, we <laughs> can hear you. Oh, oh okay. Because all of a sudden you cut out. You just got, dumped. You just well, we've dumped been. Out. I don't know if people have been. Uh, people have been all over social media. I texted y'all, so check your your phone. But it's yeah. it's like really really bad static, like bad bad bad. Uh -oh. And uh, the engineers know, and there's actually an engineer in here now. He's on the phone, so I'm okay. sure it's going to get fixed. I know everybody can look at the lines are full. We know <laughs> we are not yes. stupid. Lots of messages on Twitter. We have yeah. ears. Like <laughs> what you <laughs> hear, one, one guy I says hear. He can't hear us at all. I don't know if that's accurate, but yeah, that's the thing. And 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 the engineer's right. And I don't know who's fun. Not pointing fingers, but he's right. We I'm, like my Mike. I sound fine when you guys talk. Is when the the static is happening. Oh, and I hear nothing. We hear it perfectly. Yeah, and perfect. you hear that's to be really accurate about it. You sound crystal. We sound crystal. Everything's fine. Yeah. yeah. So anyway. Anyway, anyway I, I live. And I uh, we got blessed with the release. <laughs> yeah, I saw. And it was the scariest thing. I'm, and then so then so uh, when they oh, so, finally, wait. Oh, maybe that's technical. She just disappeared. We lost her again. Uh oh. I, I oh, yeah. Testies, testies, one, two, three. I feel like she's pissed now. Testies, testies. Obviously, Robert's really disappear. Right, we're on connection issues. Uh, uh, Monica, go uh, now. Just go to break. Yeah. Okay. Still here. We'll go to break now. All right. This is JP Song. Thank you. <laughs> Old man. Yeah. Let's get the whole thing. I love jams. it. I love it. All right. Try to get this whole thing figured out. Oh man, look at my life. 